Firstly, some facts about dissolved acetylene. Between 2003 and the end of 2012, the UK Fire and Rescue Service operated a significantly excessive and very disruptive protocol for dealing with fires involving acetylene cylinders. This original protocol caused much misinformation to circulate about the behaviour of acetylene in response to fire, and in turn influenced the Health and Safety Executive and many ancillary bodies, such as insurers, to recommend that oxycetylene should be replaced by oxypropane were possible. Following detailed research, this has since been reassessed through the BAM research project. The Fire and Rescue Service protocol for acetylene fires was officially changed with effect of the 30th of November 2012. The reality now is that an acetylene fire need be no more disruptive than any other fire involving gas cylinders, and in many scenarios, oxycetylene is the safer option to choose. Acetylene versus propane. Fuel gases are generally hydrocarbon based and are chosen for their ability to burn in air or oxygen. Two of the most popular fuel gases are acetylene and propane. However, these gases have many different properties and care should be taken to choose the correct gas for your particular application. Your choice of fuel gas is fundamental to the quality, safety, efficiency and cost effectiveness of your fabrication processes. Detailed guidance on the use of fuel gases and associated equipment is available in BCGA CP7, the safe use of oxy-fuel gas equipment. When it comes to gas welding, acetylene is the only option out of the two gases, as the flame that propane produces is far too oxidising to produce sound quality welds in carbon steel. While both gases can be used for cutting and brazing procedures, acetylene is more flexible and can be used for a wider variety of cutting and welding processes. Additionally, as acetylene is lighter than air, acetylene is a preferred gas of choice for underground work as it will not collect at ground level. Out of the two gases, acetylene has a high flame temperature with a temperature of 3160 degrees centigrade compared to propane, which is 2,828 degrees centigrade. This means that acetylene has the highest heat transfer rate and matching it with propane would require much larger nozzle sizes, excessive oxygen or near nozzle lift-off conditions. Cutting and heating speeds are therefore achieved at a much quicker rate when using acetylene, which is shown in our short demonstration.